Hey everyone, Ray OTNJ here, gonna bring you the greatest NES game of all time, Total Recall. And if you know, that was being, I was being sarcastic on that one. <laughs> yeah. But this is gonna be a, a fairly short one, so why don't we get right into it? You're also gonna hear the greatest doot doo doo of all time. And let's go. Alrighty, here we go, Total Recall, the jankiest game of all time. You got guys in, in trash cans shooting at you. You got guys in guns. And you got a buddy Richter coming. So I'm going to try for a skip right here. And I did not get it. That's fine. Yes, that, that's the primary thing. You need Richter walking towards you. You need the trash man gunning you. And then the car is going to come by. So you need all three of those plus bullets on the screen in order to get the skip to work. Wow. And then at the same time, you need, to, you need to start mashing jump and punch at the same time to propel you forward, to hope you can get it. <laughs> so since we missed it, we have to go through the entire level. It's not that long. It's only an extra 45 seconds where you can go through these sections of guards who jump at you from windows four at a time. Sometimes they'll throw out some GMX. It's how, it's how we regain our health with a little bit of soft drinks. And we're just going to make this jump to where the end of the first level is. And now it's now it's time to can I think it's time for a divorce. So time time to get some Sharon st stone action in here. Gonna punch her three times to get her gun, and then we're just gonna shoot her each time. Gotta keep it until she dies. You want to be quick enough because if you don't do it, Richter comes in and immediately kills you in one. Oh no, not not Richter, the doctor. The funny thing was I didn't realize she was there. It looked like you. <laughs> So now, so now we're already at the airport. The, the big thing with this level is that you need to kill four guard, uh, guardsmen here, but the key is you must make sure they die on screen or the game does not count it. So once you kill the third one, you can just start running forward. And once you're done, you're gonna crash right through. And now we're onto the, I mean, we are onto the subway. So there's a lovely skip in here that you can kill the guard quickly off screen. What we need to do is get them off screen, start mashing, and we, there we go. There's the first one. Gotta watch it for the dogs. See if we can get the second one. There we go, we got the second one. Two for two. Number three. Okay, we, 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 missed, we missed one of them. Oh, we wanna make sure, cause this game is janky, and ooh, if he fell out of bounds on the right side, we might have soft locked. And there we go, already done with the subway. Now for the great, I'm gonna call the best sound of the, on the NES. And I hope you love Doo Doo Doo, because you will hear it every screen, screen transition right here. Anyone who knows who's run this game knows it well. And ever since Big 2012, oh, sorry, since that's Cathalon in 2019, this has become a meme on my channel. Okay, we just gotta... Gonna traverse through the subway. I'm, gonna, I'm actually gonna have to play it a little safe when I get to the boss. Because my health is not in the greatest situation. But the boss isn't the issue. It's going to be the two enemies before it. So when we get there, I'm going to play it safe and kill them. And maybe we'll get lucky. And we'll get some GMX along the way. Is that how you pronounce it? Uh, <laughs> I'm, used to, I'm used to how Zerola says it. So that's what I'm used to. I would trust him. <laughs> I would too. Okay, we didn't get anything, but that's fine. Now, there's a little trick with this boss here. We want to get behind him and duck whenever he throws. And we want to make sure not to constantly mash jump because there is a frame after he catches it, but it goes behind him. If you look closer, you can actually see it. There we go. And now I... Oh, boy. I, oh, that's right. You take a full bar of health when he kills you. Now we have to be really careful because we're maybe two hits away from death. And one of these will, will is a one-shot kill as of right now. Okay. Maybe we'll get lucky and get some... No, no health pickup. That's fine.
Okay, there we go. We survived. Okay, as of right now, we have made a checkpoint because now it's time to get to Asamas. <laughs> so if we were to somehow game over at the very first level, you go into the movie theater and, and it would bring you here. Since we're low on health, eh, you know what? Let's go for it. Let's. So there's four sections of this game that you this level that you need to go to. They're all the same except in the second and fourth one, there's going to be an enemy on the bottom. So I'm going to hold right and A here to j automatically jump up here and then immediately fall. Okay, I'm... Oh, no, get up there. You want... We do not want to be on the ground when he throws those grenades because if you're near the glass when it shatters, you are sucked onto Mars. And then your eyes pop off for good. Ah, there it is. I knew it was going to happen. I had to go for it. But that's fine. I was going to take the intentional death originally, but... The extra health is not a bad thing here. I'm not sure. I'm going to say pineapple because I don't know the flavors. That wouldn't be a bad one. Now I'm going to ignore it because he... Okay, there we go. Because if I had, if, the thing is, if I had survived this stage, I was going to die in the next stage anyway, which is the driving stage. Anyone who runs this knows that stage is the greatest car simulator of all time. <laughs> mm-hmm. Already, we have the... Jump. There we go. And there we go. We are done with the, the, the airport on Mars. Now we have the driving seat. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, I haven't done that in a long time. Yeah, that one car that hit me is, is Richter's car, and he is an instant kill. So I'm going to play it safe. Okay, my gun did not want to fire there. So we're going to play the, the, we'll play the driving part safe. But you have to go through the section three separate times. And it and all three times it's the exact same layout. Except there's one small difference towards the end of the third time. And, and the driving is a little weird when it comes to this game. Like you can you press right to speed up and left to slow down. But with everything on the screen, it lags, and you cannot... The game doesn't recognize your movements if it's too much on the screen. And there we go. We're done with the driving. Now we are in the... We are now in the town. Now, I have to be very careful here, because there's actually a soft lock towards the end of the stage. And I have to make sure that I am not holding any key, anything on the controller on terms of the D-pad when we get there. Now, if we get it, we got to celebrate because we, we got a glitch ending, I guess. Oh, what? Okay, that's fine. You know what? Since we died earlier, I'm going to get this as a safety. There's an extra one up. <laughs> there we go. Already done with the stage. Now we are in the cavern. Let's see if I can get... There we go. Oh, that's a tough jump. Now, if you know the movie, we have our we have our bunny, our buddy Benny, who has five kids. Oh. oh, good. We just had enough, so we should be able to get, well, we should be able to defeat Benny without a problem. But the problem is Benny doesn't have any kids, and he's lying, and he lied to us. So now we got to kill him for his lying. We don't like liars around here. So he's not too tough of a boss, but you have to kill him quickly because he does slowly move closer on each iteration. There we go. We're going to take that quick death to make it easier. It makes this section a little faster. We're really low on health. We're just going to take the quick death and then reset. <clears throat> so how this section works is that these flying guys you need to kill first. If you don't kill them, if you kill the workers first, they keep respawning until you kill the flying guys. Okay, so on this... 
last section, on the third little lightning, we're going to jump over here. The reason why we got that, we get the one up, it's nice, but it, so but it stops the lag from this section here. And then we're going to get to the end, and we're already at Cohagen. So we're going to play it a little safer and go in front of the mechanism and just fire just before he hits the ground. And time will be once screen transitions. And time. There we go. And once again, now the question is, was it real or was it a dream? It's for you to figure out and find out yourself. But that's going to, that's Total Recall. And that's going to be it for me. And I hope you enjoy the, the other runs that happen.